Hey guys, this is Dan from iPadJailbreak.com. I was going to show you how to uh, download or download torrents on your iPad and be able to play them. Uh, start off, I use I iTransmission. So you just head out here, Insidia, find iTransmission 2, I iOS Homebrews, the creator. So you can see I already have this downloaded here. You just, hit, you just basically hit that and hit install. Here's iTransmission after you install it. You can jump into your browser here, through here, and you can uh, search for the torrent you like. Uh, or you can do it through Safari, which is how I do it. Just head over to IsaHunt or any other torrent client or website. Um, let's say I look for the for weeds here. Season eight just came out it was not that long ago. Episode 1. Alright, you can see 18 weeks ago. 16 weeks ago. Looks like it has some positive reviews. And you just click here on the download torrent. It'll pop up and ask you what you want to open it with. You can see it says you can open in something else, or you can pick iTransmission here. Select that. That'll add a new transfer here. As you can see uh, I get got Weeds Season 7 downloading right now, and uh, Season 8, Episode 1 is just start, getting ready to start. There's a few preference here, preferences here in iTransmission. Uh, you can set Wi-Fi network if you only want to do it in cellular or don't want to have it uh, downloading in cell, cellular. A few other ports, uh, peer maximums and stuff like that, and the limits. Pretty simple. Um, now for something that's done, you just select this here, and you can go down here to the files. So you can see I have a few of these done, like uh, episode one of season seven. You just click that, and you can open it with uh, your player, Dropbox, or iFile. You select the iFile here. Uh, it takes a little bit. Of, it takes a few seconds for it to to open. You can see I can just pick uh, Cine Player. You can pick any any other players that you have to to play your videos in. And you're also able to uh, see now I pulled it to my file structure here in iFile. As you can see, I have season I have it right here. And again, you can select the video player Dropbox. So let's just say I'll pick Cine Player. I could have done that the first time too. I just give you a feel for where you can see it in iFile. So now let's jump into Cine Player, Cine X Player. If you'd like to stream it, go ahead. You can see it's received there. There you have it. Other than that, there's nothing else I can think of that you need to have for iTransmission to work. Uh, you just go ahead and download to your iPad directly. I wouldn't recommend doing it on, on your cellular data. Uh, it's going to ping your limits. Otherwise, uh, let me know if you have any questions or comments. Thanks.